So this is the Ducati. As you can see, it has Termigani exhaust. Those are expensive exhaust, all right? The bike is dirty. I don't really, I'm not a fanatic of washing bikes too much. As you can see, it got scrapes. I kind of painted it a little bit red. See, but there's some more scrape. It's never really falling hard on anything like that. That was actually my mistake for um, not putting the stand on. So right here, it's going to be getting brand new pads, so you'll know, so it's going to have brand new pads soon. Tire still in great shape, brand new fork seals. Putting the brake pad soon, front and back. On this side, really nothing major. The bike has never fallen on this side, just scrapes and stuff. This is actually old. This is a 2008 Ducati A48. This I was actually going to paint black, and I changed my mind. Back tire is brand new. This back tire has maybe 50 miles on it. Brand new Continental Conti Sport. I think it is Attack. So it's brand new. So I just want you to have an idea so you could see the bike yourself. All the lights work. It's the bike as a whole. All right, now we go to the top. I do have the back cow, the one that goes here, plus the seat that's coming with the bike. Mm -hmm. Of course, it has this small flaws and stuff. It's a used bike. It has two set of black key, all right? It has two keys. It has no code card, just the key. There's definitely ways of getting the keys. And I actually have a guy here in mass let me put this in there so you can see actually him in case you got problems with the with cold cards this guy right here he'll make you a cold card and give but you if you have any problems you need a key you need a cold card he's able to um get you the keys and he's able to get you a cold card so he'll do one cold card and two black keys for about 350 dollars that's a good deal you know so call him up if you need keys for ducatis or anything else this ram mount i keep this if i sell it but i'll leave the one inch bow in there those are hard to get i went through hell to get it each one is the mounts are different on my kawasaki it was in here had a hole it was there and now it was on the side so i'll leave that but i'll take the ram mount here you go that's the alarm okay i want to show you any defects right there that's broken, but it still works. The lights work, the high beam. Everything else is good. And um, so on this side. And um, though mostly the scrapes are from Megani exhaust again, very expensive for those of you that know about them. Again, you already know the tire is a brand new Continental Conti Motion, I believe, attack. Brand new, about uh, 50 miles on the Molly. Okay, mainly scrapes are here. I was gonna paint the bike, but um, I kind of don't want to anymore. I just want to get me a new Suzuki um, Jigster, so maybe 2013 and up. That's the reason why I'm just getting rid of this. I've had three bikes all together. Uh, Triumph Daytona, um, which one was the other one? Kawasaki, and then this one, so I sold the other ones. I have too many bikes and you know, I don't ride all the time. But these Ducatis, they're, they're pretty good. This one runs strong, no no defects. It's like, in the engine, it runs strong. Okay, now the only thing I'm gonna tell you right now, I did replace the voltage regulator. 
because as you know there's an issue with them blowing up or going defective so I did put a MOSFET one a good one I bought a nice brand new MOSFET regulator for this bike 215 bucks and they're they run much cooler so I put it in there I've had no problem everything's running good so you see the bike as a whole you know no issues let me turn it on because let me turn it on for y'all who want to hear it. There we go. too many questions and you'll see it as a whole so that's the reason you know not any really other money just want to get rid of it and buy something else I don't want to have two bikes at the same time because we ain't rich by no means we're not rich okay we have a little thing right there see? like minimal things minimal things all right, thank you for watching, guys. Leave your comments on the bottom. Anybody interested, this is located in Midwest, Massachusetts. Okay, and I'm selling it. 6,000.